Good afternoon, everyone. This is Christy with Van Line Company. It is Wednesday, August 19th. I'm going to go over the markets with you. So corn market down two cents on the day as we kind of decipher it. What do we have out there for a crop? Do we have a problem? What will USDA do with the issues in Iowa? You're starting to have pro farmer work through parts of Iowa. They won't be done with Iowa until tomorrow, but they did get through some of the parts, especially like that D3 drought area. And there's been a lot of variability out there, but from the most part, what I've been seeing is that, hey, these are really dry conditions. They aren't the best, but the corn is still hanging in there, uh, which is evident that there was a lot of subsoil moisture. And so corn market a little bit weaker today. Um, rest of the market's finding just some slight strength. So soybeans up a half cent. Uh, wheat complex anywhere from three and a half higher to seven higher in Kansas City wheat. So overall, not a lot of movement. We get export sales tomorrow, and that will be a big thing for this market as we need to drum up that business consistently. Meat markets were all just uh, about a dollar higher across the board, just below that for some of the cattle contracts. Hogs just above that for most of theirs. So seeing that support over there, outside market's pretty quiet. So tomorrow's driving force is going to be export sales, and we'll have to see what they say. Also seeing the rest of Pro Farmer uh, to kind of get a grip on what they're thinking that's out there. I do have to close up the disclaimer. Trading futures and option of all sorts of is not suitable for all producers. This is a solicitation. Have a great day.